In this screencast, I'm going to show you how to upload an image to Text Pattern. So on the Images tab, I'm just going to click Browse, and on my desktop I have an image I'd like to add called Microformats Empowering JPEG. So then I'll just click Upload. This takes me to the Individual Images page. Um, for the thumbnail, you have a couple of options. You can use Text Pattern to generate a thumbnail of the size you want. Um, you can specify either the width or I could specify the height. And it'll size the image proportionally. Or if I want to crop the image, I could specify the width and the height and click Create and you can see that it crops the image there. So I actually want a 240 pixel wide thumbnail uncropped. So I'm going to do that. And then my category is book covers. In the alternate text, this text is for people who cannot see the image. Low vision users, blind users, people who are using um, screen reading browsers. So I want to be quite dis descriptive of exactly what the image is. So I'm going to put in cover of micro formats and this is the full name of the book here. Markup for Web 2.0. And in this particular context, I don't use a caption, but the caption would be um, can be whatever you want it to be. Uh, something funny, clever, something describing the image. Um, whereas the alternate text really should stick to you know, what description would be most useful for someone who cannot see the image. So I'm just going to save that. So now we see that the image is installed in text pattern and if I ever need to edit it, change the thumbnail size or whatever, I can just click on it. And I can also, um, much like the articles tab, um, I can do some operations with several images at once, namely changing the category or deleting them. And I can also um, do a search uh, if I know, um, for example, if I know I put in micro formats in the alternate text, I can do a search on that and these two books are returned. So. That is the Images tab in Text Pattern.